I look like absolute shit, guys. I also look like I haven't slept in nine days. I haven't slept in nine days. Please send help. Yeah, I am a little fucked up too. Let's be real here. I'm always a little. You know me. You know your boy. What are we here for again? Oh yeah, the the hit or miss fuckers. They're they're back at it again. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm referring to the song known as Mia Khalifa. You play with them balls like it's FIFA. It's this really shitty diss track against Mia Khalifa. The diss track was done by this duo named I Love Friday. They apparently did the diss because of this tweet that was sent out by Mia Khalifa, uh, dissing the female member of the the group. However, it was a fake tweet. Mia Khalifa never tweeted at this bitch none of that shit ever happened so these people made this diss track based off this fake beef and everything and uh due to tiktok they went viral off of it got shit tons of views i think like i don't know 80 million views i don't know there was a lot of millions of views their music is absolute fucking garbage uh, they have the mia khalifa song as well as other such classics as travel man and crackhead uh, now, the duo is made up of one uh, member named Zeno Carr, he's the male member, and he seems to be the producer, he makes the beats, and he mixes the music, and he also does rap and do, like, I don't, I don't think it's called singing, but he does something and on, on the beat, whatever the fuck that is. And they have the female, which is uh, Smoke Hijabi, however, apparently recently she changed her name to Oxa, apparently that's her real name or something like that, so she's just going by that. So that is the, the duo. Whoa, they are apparently, well, presumably incestuous lovers. I don't know why, for the longest time I thought they were siblings, but no, apparently they are indeed just a couple, and they make music together. Uh, so after their viral hit of, you know, Hit or Miss, they had a couple more songs drop, uh, but most recently they dropped a song called Get Grip, and we're going to be listening to that here in a minute to give it a little bit of review, but there's just, there's so much of their music that I've heard so far that I absolutely cannot stand, and it's just so laughably bad that I don't understand how they have a fan base I, I get the feeling that mostly people just like to listen to make fun of it I'm not a hundred percent sure though if you do go to the comments you know you get tons of people saying terrible ass all that shit but they do have half a million subscribers uh, also apparently before they were making music on their channel they were making vlogs and then one day they decided to upload the travel band song which got you know a little bit of clout and then they went ahead and they continued down the music road to the point where now you can't find their vlogs anymore and you can only see uh, the music on their channel i think that specifically the female uh it, her voice just does not work over the various beats for me i just don't care for it it's auto-tuned to hell in various songs and it, the flow is very i mean there's a couple maybe okay parts sometimes there's a couple make one or two maybe good bars here or there very very seldom honestly uh and then it's nothing super unique and i'm not saying that you have to be super unique but if you're not going to be super unique you have to at least make it sound good and and to me it just doesn't sound good when it comes to xeno car i think that he is also shit over the beats like he cannot like, he's not very good at rapping or singing or whatever the fuck he does i i don't really know uh he definitely raps as part of it, but like some parts it sounds like he's trying to do like this singy thing with his voice however is he is the producer of the various beats apparently sometimes in collaboration with other people and it is the beats i think are actually quite interesting and quite good I, i'm personally one of these people that enjoy the new age beats well xeno car at least in the producing aspect seems to be somebody who has a good bit of talent but this rap duo the, with the, the 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 vocals part is what fucks it all up okay so first revelation it's Zeno car, not Zeno car. Beats fire, as I mentioned before. Flow is a little weird. Lyrics are super basic. It sounds so familiar. I mean, the music video is just the basic shit. And I mean, it could be better, but it could be a lot worse too. So, I mean, I'm not one to like. I'm not one to really complain about music videos. Like, if you got a music video and you can see you and you're singing and everything else, then that's a music video. Like, I don't need much depth to my music videos. But okay. Oh no. Okay, 
bro came in hard i'm not gonna lie bro came in sounding way better than he ever has on any beat that i've heard him on and then he went with that with that weird like pitch shifty thing again that he does in his vocals for some reason and i don't i don't fuck with that it does not sound good okay so that's get a grip i i'm not too sure if i was gonna edit some in there and actually show it uh any bits of it or not overall uh way better than their other songs to be perfectly fair preferred to hear zeno car go for the whole song and like see him do different flows and shit and see what he could have done with it because i think he definitely sounded way way better than he has on any other songs there was a couple of parts where he did his whole pitch shift that, like thing and I, I don't fuck with that it doesn't sound very good but other than that it, it sounded way better than previously so i still think the music is trash but that is a step up i've got to give people their props on that when they, they they one up themselves from you know what they were doing before as long as you're progressing and moving forward and doing better that's what matters all right another thing guys but if i hit 15 likes i will attempt to make a diss track on these motherfuckers now if you've been around this this channel or my personality for a long time like the personality persona rocky that i've created then you'll know that way back in the day um back when VidMe was a thing and i was a bit popular over there i would make diss tracks and shit uh however my musical skills have progressed a lot since then like a lot a lot and i haven't really done a diss track other than one kind of at the beginning of the year or just earlier on in the year that was you know it was okay but even since then i progressed a lot so, so uh, i'm gonna go for 15 likes if we hit 15 likes on this video which i do not think will happen but if we hit 15 then i'll go ahead and i'll do that diss track that's about it thank you guys for watching this episode of um weird shit with rocky i'll see you in in the next video Bye bye